Hey there, friend. Welcome back to Daily Dose Radio here in the Bible Bistro. And today we begin the prayer section of uh, Psalm 108. But before we start, I think I should remind you that Daily Dose Radio is going to be silent for about three weeks. I take off at Christmas time, three weeks, and that'll begin next week. So the week of the 18th through the 27th, uh, I will not be on the air. I'm sorry, the week of the 18th through the 22nd. And then the 25th through the uh, 29th, and then the following week, which is the first week of January. So I'll be back January the, what date is that? January the 8th. I'll be back on the air with Daily Dose Radio, and we will jump into Psalm 109 when I get back. Psalm 109 is another two-parter, so we're going to do that in two pieces. Uh, Just to remind you, so I won't be back until January the 8th. So I know that's a long time, but there are other possibilities for your listening. You can listen to Creek Road Baptist Pulpit. You can listen to old episodes of Daily Dose Radio. You can check out some of the videos that I've recorded in the Questions podcast. So just uh, go there. and Oh, and of course, also the Sunday morning worship uh, videos are there as well. So check out what you want, and I'll be back on the 8th of January. Today we're looking at verses 10 and 11, and as I said, we begin the prayer section. Who will bring me into the strong city? Who will lead me into Edom? Wilt not thou, O God, who hast cast us off? Wilt not thou, O God, go forth with our hosts? So David is he's complaining just a little bit here in his prayer, isn't he? He's Who's going to bring me into the strong city? You know, it's really wonderful the way questions are used by the psalmists. Not only David, but the others as well. For example, the probably one of the most famous questions of all is found there in Psalm 121. Uh, where does my help come from? He says, my help comes from the Lord. I will look into the hills from whence cometh my help. My help comes from the Lord. So here, we have, who will bring me into the strong city? Who will lead me into Edom? So apparently there's conflict going on with Edom, and David's not winning that conflict. So he's asking the question, who? He knows the answer before he asks the question. Wilt not thou, O God, who has cast us off? Now apparently some, some sin has caused the, the loss to the Edomites. Maybe the Moabites are a part of that as well. We can go back and look at several different conflicts that David had with both of those groups as well as the, the Philistines. And so he's he's in despair. He he knows that God must go or they won't they won't have victory. So will you not, O God, who has cast us off? Will you not will not thou, O God, go forth with our hosts? So a wonderful prayer that he makes here. Again, this is coming out of Psalm sixty, verses nine and ten. So he, he's making a prayer, kind of a, like a little complaint, and then tomorrow he comes to his request full-throated. Uh, he doesn't beat around the bush anymore. And he gives us some wonderful theology and some wonderful promise. And it's promise based on what the Lord said of himself. All of this is mine. Gilead, Manasseh, Ephraim, Moab, Edom, Philistia. Why, need, why does David need to worry? The Lord is in control of all of that. And so now, when, when David comes to the, to the nut of the issue here, he turns around and he says, will you not go with us now? Will you not go forth with our armies? So tomorrow we'll pick up there in 12 and read 12 and 13. Again, some more from Psalm 60. So if you haven't read those passages yet, I hope that you will. All right, so join me then here on Daily Dose Radio. Thanks for listening to Daily Dose Radio. For more fresh and delicious Bible studies, podcasts, books, and more, check out the Bible Bistro online and on YouTube. Join me again next time for Daily Dose Radio.